We are in Kichijoji, Tokyo. We're still pretty new to Tokyo, but we found this amazing place that we fall in love with. Come, let us take you there. And now we wait. Okay, there's actually like a really funny story as to how we found this place. It was our, I think our very first day and we saw this place with this huge lineup and I was like, that looks a lot like that food place that the Solitary Gourmet went to in that Japanese drama that we watched. So the Solitary Gourmet is this like amazing show with this Japanese salary man who just like goes from food place to food place. He just literally sits there and eats at a restaurant and he like ooms and ahs at how good it was. <gasps> it's happening. So we are getting the menchi katsu. Ah, see, I could read a little bit about it. And it's 180 if you get five each. So all together, that's going to be do math. at least two dollars. Arigato. The time is now. We got the goods. Can you smell that meaty onion? Guys, you need to just... Oh. I feel like Simon's been maybe eating a little bit too much meat lately. I think the best thing to do is for you to take this home. Oh. And I'm just gonna eat all these for you. That's fair, I'll just have some um, seaweed on the side. Let's go have some seaweed, it'll be uh, good. Okay. As you know, I'm the meat lover in the family, uh, so I think it only makes sense. What if it's full of poison? Uh, well, I, you know. I think you're fair. All right, good. Uh, so this is the Martina Eats Meat Show, which doesn't sound right now that I think that over, so. Let's think of a new title. Martina eats meatballs. Still doesn't sound good. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. You ready? Yeah, you can have some. Are you ready for this? Oh. This is what it's all about. Look at that juice. Okay, do you want to eat it? Yeah, we got to eat it together. Hey, you know what? It would have been a really good idea if we told people the name of this place. This we place. literally just got in line and then yeah. we were like... <laughs> it's called Sato. Sato. <laughs> What's amazing about this is that this is beef filled and we're pretty sure it's made with some kind of like epic prime Japanese beef. It just smells so sweet. The onions are soft. Okay, the let's meat just bite into tender. this before we lose our mind. Oh my God, Simon didn't even wait for me. Mmm. This is... Hot. The most magical, so loving so meatball. So We've had croquets before. Usually the outside might be more like bready. This one is like a really, really, really delicate, thin, eggy crust. Mm. And the inside is just jam packed with the most buttery ground beef ever. Usually, there's no nubbles of fat. Like, whenever you do meatballs like this, the meat becomes very overcooked and dry in the middle. But here, they've mm. captured all the juice, they've sealed it with this magical barrier, this like force field of meat juice. It's so good. You know, I just realized I've only had croquets in Korea and Japan. I know croquets are a French word. Mm. I don't know what they actually are. I've only known them as like crusty bread filled with meat. That's really true. What is a croquet? Guys, it is really honestly worth the trip out to Kichijoji to get these. You will not be, you will not be upset with us. You're not gonna be like, oh, it was all right. Like it is so good. Are you only on your second ball? Good thing we bought five balls. <laughs> Trust Japanese lineups, they know What's a good thing to eat? Guys, I wish you could try this. This place is legit. I wish you could try this. These people line up for a reason. One thing we need to learn in Japan, how do you ask for tissues? I've just been secretly wiping in a Martina's ass anyway. I sure there has to be Maybe a more proper way. Maybe we can just do like a way. spirited way, just go up and be like, eh, eh, eh. If you guys want to know how to get here, um, click on the link to our blog post. We're going to put a detailed explanation on how to find this place. Please include it in your plans if you come to Tokyo. Mm. You really, really need to. Tichi Joji is just awesome altogether. He's clapping in the background like, yeah, come visit us. I would pick this over ice cream any day. I'm sorry. Ice cream, meat bowl. Mm, 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 mm. You're supposed to save one for our friend, but... Mm, 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 mm.